everything we do is about retention, right? Because an existing client is worth five times the amount of a new client. And that's a fact, right? So, you know, I think one of the big mistakes is that we don't put enough attention on retaining our clients and are so obsessed with, with getting new clients. And we got to remember that, you know, we, if we get a, even if we get a hundred new clients, right? How many of them are tire kickers? How many of them are people who just want to, want ancillary products, stuff like that? So it, it, being in business, we all want to do the same thing. We all want to retain our clients and we all want to make everybody sticky to us. Like I want my clients to be sticky to me, right? So I want to offer them enough products that they don't have to go to somebody else. Or I want to be great at, you know, at what I'm doing to make sure that no matter what, it, it's not a matter of price, it's not a matter of anything, they're going to stay with us. But, you know, putting out yard signs, putting out stickers, you know, putting out, um, you know, email newsletters, uh, sending a direct mail piece, you don't need to associate the advertising with the response because the advertising's purpose when you're doing retention is to make sure that you keep that client, make sure that they know the other services that you offer, you know, um, that, that when they do a small job with you, that when the big job comes, they're not going back to the pool, they're going with you. So you need to, to remain top of mind. Uh, there's no doubt that over the course of a year, your, your existing clients will outperform anything and everything by, by 100x. Um, so knowing that, it's not worth losing those clients by not staying in their face because somebody else is, right? Somebody else definitely is.